In this video, we're going to solve puzzle 91 from Sudoku to Go, volume 125 by Soap Opera Digest. We'll be using Sudoku patterns and techniques together to easily solve this diabolical puzzle. Go to sudokuprimer.com to learn more about patterns, the patterns and the techniques we'll be using um, to solve this puzzle. You can also find lots of other Sudoku information on sudokuprimer.com. Now to get started, I'm going to talk about the opposite pattern. If we look at box one here, um, we've got a seven and a nine in opposite corners, and that's the opposite pattern. What can we do with that pattern? Well, we can look at the row, the middle, I mean the middle column that goes through that box and the middle row that goes through that box and see if we can find two numbers that are in both the column and the row that aren't already in the box. And if we find two numbers that meet those requirements, we, we know that they're twins and they go in these two corners. We happen to have a 4 and an 8 in the column and a 4 and an 8 in the row and therefore we know these are 4-8 twins. Okay, now knowing these 4-8 twins we can't solve them yet but knowing that they're there will make uh, this opposite pattern turn into a a hidden plus pattern. We know what goes in all four corner boxes so therefore the the cells we don't know about yet are the, the middle column cells and the middle row cells which form a plus pattern. Now you can see plus pattern and uh, all these other patterns on sudokuprimer.com. Now um, since we know there's a hidden plus pattern here we can look for numbers in this column and in this row that aren't already in the box. There's a 5 here that's not in the box yet, so we know a 5 has to go here or here. There's a 1 here that's not in the box yet, so we know that a 1 has to go here or here. We can't solve eat the 1 or the 5 or the 4 8 twins, but keep those in mind because we'll be able to use those in a minute. Now let me get started here. I'm going to fill in that 7 there. That's obvious. And by the way, if I put in a number or if I do something that you don't understand, please leave a comment and I'll try and answer your questions. Okay, now with that 7 there, um, there's something else interesting. We've got a 2 and an 8 in, row, in this row here and a 2 and an 8 in this row already, so we know these are two 8 twins. We can't solve those yet. But that helps us find these other two numbers, which are 3, 4 twins. And we can solve those because there's a 3 there. All right. Now we've got a 3 here and a 3 here. So we know this is a 3 because of that 3 there. We also know that this is a 3. And you might ask, well, couldn't this be a 3? Well, it could be, but um, we've got a 3 here in this row and a 3 in this column, so we know we have ghost 3s here. Now, ghost numbers is another technique that you can learn about on sudokuprimer.com. So that's how we knew that that was a 3 and, and not that. All right. Now, let's look at box 4. And here is where the power of patterns and te techniques together start coming coming together. We've got a 3 and a 9 here and a 3 and a 9 here. So we know 3 and 9 can't fit either here or here in this box. So we have 3 9 twins right here. Alright, let's see what else we know. Um, we've got a 4 and a 5 here. So we know one of these is a 4 and one of these is a 5 because we got a 4 and a 5 here too. So we know that can't be a 4 or a 5. 
So one of these is a 4, one of these is a 5. But remember the 1 here? We've got a 1 in the middle column already in box 1. So that can't be a 1. So now we have 1, 4, 5 triplets. And with the 3, 9 twins and the 1, 4, 5 triplets, the only two numbers we don't know are these two, and we can find them pretty easily. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So these are 6 and 7, and we can solve those because of that 6 there. All right. Now let's look over at this box right here. We've got a 4 and a 5 in this column. We've got a 4 and a 5 in this column, so we know these are 4, 5 twins also. So we know that these triplets, 1, 4, 5, this can only be a 1 because we have 4, 5 twins there. Alright, so you see how powerful this hidden plus pattern is. And of course we got some help with these twins, these 3, 9 twins and these uh, 4, 5 twins that we found, and the 2, 8 twins. But now let's look at this row right here. We already know all but one number, and by deduction we can find that number. We know there's a 1 here, a 2 here or here, 3, 4, 5, 6. So that has to be a 6, 7, 8, 9. Because the 3, 9 twins, the 2, 8 twins, the 4, 5 twins, we know that is a 6. We also know there's ones there, so that's a one right there. All right, let's look at box eight here. We've got a four here and a four here, so we know that's a four. And with that four filled in, we know this is a five. We've got sevens here, so we know that's a seven. Right. All right. Now let's remember our four eight twins we have found at the very beginning with this opposite pattern here. Well, we know that one of these has to be an eight because we've got an eight here. So we have ghost eights here, so we know that's a four, and that's an eight. All right. Now, um, we have a corner pattern right here um, in this in box seven with these four numbers here. And by the way, I didn't mention it, but remember the three nine twins here before we filled in the one, six, and seven? We had a hidden corner pattern here. I just wanted to point that out because um, before we filled in this one and six here and that six there, we could see that a six could fit only fit in one of these two cells uh, before we put the 1 and 6 and 7 in because we had a 6 there. We have a hidden corner pattern there. Just wanted to point that out. Uh, now with this corner pattern in, in box 7, we've already got a 5 and a 4 in that box, but we don't have a 6 or a 1, so we know that the 1 and 6 go here. 1, 6 twins. We can't solve them, but we know they go there. And that leaves one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine here, which we can solve. And now with that nine there, we can solve the three nine twins that we found at the be early on, at the, close to the beginning of the of the puzzle. And we can solve these four five twins here because we've got a four there. You see how many numbers we found just because of this um, hidden plus pattern that we found up here. 
All right, now we've only got, now we've got a real, a, a plus pattern here. It's not hidden anymore because we solved the four eights. And we've got all the numbers in this middle column. So we know that, we know these two numbers here are, let's see, four, five. One of them's five. Got a nine there, a seven there, a three. Three and five, and there's an eight there. So we know that these are three and five, and we can solve those. And we're only missing two numbers in row seven here. We can fill those in. All right. All right, let's look at this column right here. We're missing one, two, five, six, two, five, and six. There's a five there and a six there. So we know that's a two. Now we're only missing eight and nine in this column, so we can solve those. And uh, here we had a, a plus pattern also before we put that nine in. And so we knew one of these was an eight, so we know that's an eight there. Now we only have two numbers left here, four and six, so we can solve them. And with those numbers, it'll, they help us solve the one six twins we found in box seven. We know that's a, a one now. All right, now we remember our four or five twins we found. We can solve those. And we've got a seven right here. This is a five, because we've got a five there and a five there. So we know that's a five. What are we missing here? A six and a nine. Yeah, six and nine are missing here. So we know that's a nine and that's a six. Now we're missing a seven and a nine there. We can solve those. Remember our five sixes that we found in this column here. We can solve those. All right, what are we missing in box one? One, two, four, five, six. One, two, and six. So middle one is a middle row is a two. And one, six. We're only missing one number here. That's a nine. Let's see, we've got eight and nine here missing. Two eight here. Those are the two eight twins we found early, early on in the puzzle. And we're missing one, two, four. One, two, and four here. One, two, so that's a four. That's a two, that's a one. Solve our two eight twins and our eight nine twins there. All right. So with the the opposite pattern we found in box one, and then we found these four eight twins. Uh, we couldn't solve them, but that that created a hidden plus pattern here, which helped us find lots of numbers here and lots of numbers in this section right here. And, uh, and then we found a corner pattern down here so that helps us solve the eight and nine. And so using techniques and patterns together really helped us solve this puzzle pretty easily. Well, thank you for watching. And I'll see you on the next video.
video.